Hey, what's going on guys? I'm here with a really exciting video. So recently the Bigly Burst app was released and uh, people are thinking that this might be leaked since it is no longer available for download. Uh, but thankfully I downloaded it and I also recorded some gameplay for you guys. But before I begin the gameplay, I do want to give you guys some information about this app. So first off, this app is really similar to the BeybladeBattles.com app, as well as the previous Beyblade app that they had, so it's like a virtual battling system. Um, currently, you can only play by yourself, but it does feature the basic layers as well as the dual layers, so that's something that's really interesting. Um, it might hint that Hasbro will release the basic layers. The main difference in this app that I noticed is that the names. The names are completely different and I have a list of them right here. As you can see the names, most of the names have been changed and I know that a lot of people are outraged about it but really when you think about it it's just a name. I think that the fact that we still got burst here is really amazing. Another thing to know is that the parts colors are a little bit different and uh, they kind of give them these funky colors. I'm hoping that it's different in real life and that we will get the original colors. So the battle gameplay is pretty intense, I'd say. It's pretty easy to get the hang of. And the graphics are really nice, nice and smooth. So yeah, that's kind of it for the info and I'm just going to jump right into the gameplay. Guys, I'm here with some really exciting footage of the Beyblade Burst app. Now, a lot of people are saying that this app may be leaked since it is no longer available for download in the App Store. Uh, but thankfully, I still have it. Uh, but anyway, I want to show you guys some gameplay as well as some more information about it. So here's the title screen, and it does have some music. So it's literally the same song looped over and over. It's kind of annoying. But anyway, let's begin. Okay, here is Valkyrie, or what they call it now is Valtraic, or Valtric. Um, you can take a look at the parts. The Valkyrie layer is not the original color, it's actually like a black. Uh, same with Excel, it's like a dark red now, and then uh, Wing is still its original color. So, uh, what people are believing is that this app is not finished yet, and the reason is because these colors are not the actual layer colors. And here's the beast for Valkyrie, of course. And also apologize for the poor quality. I'm recording this literally off my camera. Um, here is Kerbius. It's also got some funky colors. It's got like a yellow layer, an orange, or red defense. Really weird colors. Thankfully, they didn't change the name for it. Okay, next is Rocktivator, a.k.a. Ragnarok. So, the colors seem pretty much identical except for the driver it's like a dark black I think next is Spriggan or what's now called Spryzen sorry if I mispronounce these names and the layer is also like a green or yellow and the driver is blue I think so if we go back to the bay um, each bay blade does have stats um, some cool things to know is that if you click on these, it says the battles that you've battled with that Beyblade. So I've battled against these bays. And um, this says coming soon, Avatar Track. I'm not sure what that is. Here's my username. So you can edit it. Also, you get this in app currency, which you can use to get stuff. So if I have enough coins, I can get. A Beyblade, layers, a stadium. Pretty neat, actually. And the most interesting part about this right now is that it will include a QR uh, code scanner. As you can see, I could scan something. Anyway, let's do a little battle. So right now, the only available option is training, multiplayer, and tournament are coming soon, apparently. This reminds me of the BeyblaBattles.com layout. They had that similar thing. So you can battle a random opponent, custom opponent, or recent opponent, and it is in the digital base stadium. So if you do custom opponent, you could see the other parts which are available. So for example, here is Doom Scissor. 
that is the Decyther. This is Wyvern, or what's now called Wyvron. Here is Victory Valkyrie, or what's now called Valtryk V2. Unicorn is now Unicrest. Storm Spriggan is now Spryzen S2. Rise and Ragnarok is now Rocktivator R2. Odin is now Odax. Neptune is now Nepstrius. Kaiser Kirbius is now Kirbius K2. Horse suit is still horse suit, thankfully. And yeah, you could customize your opponent, and they have all of these parts available right now, so I can make a Death Scyther. Okay. So here's the little animation that they have. Shows the beast. Pretty awesome. And here's the base stadium. It's very similar to the one that they feature in the anime. And here you have your bay logger with your launcher. So now you can uh, tilt it to aim your launch, I guess. And the cool thing is, you have to tap it in between that little range right there. Okay, that wasn't the best launch, but it worked. So if you tap this little thing here, you get like a little attack that you can use, and I won that round. Here's round two. So the point system is also like, Chikartomi burst gets you two points, and a sleep bell gets you one point. Also, these little balls around here, if you run into them, you get some kind of power boost, I believe. And if you use this, you can do your special move. Oh, too late, is what I said. Well, I think I still won. Okay, and now we're at round three. It's kind of hard to play because I'm literally watching it through my camera. Oh, yeah, they can also do special moves on you. Wow. Yeah, I think I lost that one. So these battles actually take a long time since it is first to three points. And uh, my opponent has one. I have two now. Let's see if I can win this round, though. I still won. So the cool thing is if you win battles I guess you improve your parts so I gained like extra power on all of the parts I had and uh, it glitched out because it should have shown my Beyblade. Got some bonuses which are pretty cool I guess. Anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video. For free to like, comment, subscribe and let me know what are your thoughts on this. And until next time guys, see ya.